Okay, here's my homemade uh, headrest for my cat trike. Primitive but effective. Uh, to install it, <laughs> you do that. That's a T fitting for a three quarter inch PVC pipe. I cut off about a third of it, not in half, but you want it to actually wrap around a bit so it kind of snaps onto the pipe like that. Okay, so this goes down on the bottom rail of the cat trike. Like that, okay. It just leans against the back rail, right? Here, now I'm not going to take it all apart, but it's made up of one of these fittings with about a two inch piece of pipe on either side. And then I use one of those, uh, those foam knee, uh, noodles, I think they call them, for swimming pools, slipped over. I slipped, I slipped down the back side of it, fitted it over it, and I took another one and slid it again, and I kind of bent it in half so that it would actually have a little bit of a... Sorry, this, this is one noodle sliced in half, here and here. The back side is completely cut open, and this is almost cut open, but still left attached. It forms this nice little crease that grabs the crown of your neck. Uh, microfiber tile, just to kind of pretty it up a little bit. Some zip ties. To, Tighten the microfiber up, and you're good to go. Now, the one thing I was contemplating was how to make it adjustable height-wise. I was thinking about using one of these things, but the problem is I'm not sure. I'm not sure how that would work out. It might. It might work. I, I might. I'm going to play with one of these and see if I can split the difference. So basically, put this thing right here. It'll push this board a little bit more forward like that than maybe I want. Um, but anyway, it is what it is. Oh, oh, um, I forgot. I also put a bend in it because if not, it kind of, it just didn't work right without the bend. Um, so to make the bend, that bend right there, I uh, plugged one side of the pipe with some aluminum tape, filled the pipe with sand, Heated it with the propane torch, and it got a little hot on that side, as you can see, and gently bent it. The sand, the idea behind the sand was maybe keep the pipe from uh, from collapsing on this side, pulling too thin. Kind of worked, I don't know. But yeah, I like that little bend in there. It is, that's, that's very subjective, obviously, how much you want. Like, for instance, maybe if I use the extension piece over there, I don't need any bend at all. Maybe it'll just put... I think the problem I had with the extension piece was it was interfering with the back. I'm trying to remember why. I kind of went down that route already once. I just didn't like it. But the custom bend one is perfect for me. You just measure it so that it gets the crown of your... the back of your skull fit right in that little crease there and you have these two soft bits to, to isolate the cushion a little bit. Anyway, uh, I was looking at the price of headrests and, you know, Commercial ones are $100, $150. This has cost maybe, maybe $5. So I'll stick with this. Anyway, that's it for now. Thanks for watching.